Looks like we're all here. But are we really? I knew it. We are home, aren't we? Welcome to the next circle. Hate to break it to you, but your journey's not over yet. Now, I'm sure you have plenty of new questions, but first, let's get you somewhere safe. That is the end of Goodluck's message. That son of a bitch. He's still screwing with us. The man is dead. Get angry all you want, but what good will it do now? What was that he meant by the fate of mankind resting on this mission? One thing does come to mind. It has to do with why Mr. Gruen wanted you to increase the output of the digger. I suspect it was because he was trying to bring the Lord of Dust into our world. What? That level of output truly was unnecessary for us to return home. He likely wanted to increase its size in order for the Lord of Dust to be able to go through it. But why would he want that? 
Gruen wanted to secure a large energy source, it would seem. After all, the Lord of Dust contains a massive amount of energy, far greater than any wanderer. But if something like that ended up in our world? It would pose an extremely high threat to the planet. This is only a guess, but I think Good Luck wanted to destroy the Lord of Dust to prevent Gruen from getting his hands on it. In that case, you really could say the fate of mankind rests on this mission. This has got nothing to do with me. Reeve! As far as saving the world and Good Luck's mission goes, but it looks like we're gonna have to take out that thing in order to get home. We might not be so lucky next time it attacks. Well, all right then, it's settled. Let's go find this Charon survivor Good Luck was talking about. I will continue to provide mission support, assuming you all trust me. Sorry for doubting you before. We have faith in you, Virgil. Let's make it home together. To facilitate exploration of this region, begin by activating the wormhole transporter.